Hello again guys, this is Nate with Davis Criticism Art. And for those that don't know me, I'm 10 years old and I like to learn about every type of animal and wish to become a zoologist one day. And today I have a special guest with me, my cousin Itzel. Hello and welcome. Hello. And today we're going to be talking about butterflies. Butterflies live in every continent in the world, except for Antarctica. So Itzel, what do you like about butterflies? All the different colors. Well, here we have different color butterflies and shapes and sizes. There's over 20,000 species of butterflies measuring 1.8 to almost 12 inches. There are four stages in the butterfly life cycle. First, the egg, caterpillar, pupa, then the adult. When the butterfly comes out of her pupa, then it needs to immediately drink water for its wings to expand, then wait for the wings to dry and harden before it flies. Butterflies live only for two to four weeks and focus all their energy on two tasks, mating and eating. But monarchs live up to nine months. Wow, that's a short life. How great is their eyesight? Well, within about 10 to 12 feet, butterflies can see pretty good. But a little bit over that measurement, they see a little bit blurry. Butterflies can see ultraviolet colors that is invisible to the human eye. All uh, butterflies have an all liquid diet. They have what is called a proboscis, which is curled up under its chin and works as a drinking straw. As you can see here, this is the proboscis under its chin, and here it's going in action drinking nectar. A while back, my sister took in an injured butterfly, then fed it sugar and water in a spoon, and then let it go when it was recovered. Here's a video. Butterflies can taste with their feet. They have something called taste receptors under their feet that helps them locate plants and food. I heard butterflies come from far away. Is this true? Yes, that's because they can't fly under 86 degrees. So they'll travel to, travel to distant, different regions when it's warmer. Like the painted lady butterfly and the cabbage butterfly fly for a few hundred miles. While the monarch butterfly, all the way from Mexico, for thousands of miles. I heard some butterflies are poisonous. Well, yeah, that's true. But the Antimachus swallowtail butterfly is the most poisonous in the world. This butterfly has the wingspan of 8 to 9 inches. And, but the poison on it will not kill a human or large animal. It has enough poison to kill six cats and it also lives in Uganda. This is a beautiful butterfly. Yes, indeed it is. It's the rarest butterfly. It's one of the most rarest butterflies in the world. The Palos Verdes Blue Butterfly. Presumed extinct until 1994 when they discover the population here in San Pedro, California. This is the real red sangria African butterfly. The only old red butterfly in the world. Butterflies are not just beautiful creatures, but they're important to our environment. They kind of work like bees because they bring pollen to other flowers because when they stand to another flower, they have pollen in their legs and then go to another flower. That helps our plants and vegetables and fruits. As you can see, butterflies are not just beautiful creatures, but they help our environment. 
please, next time you see a butterfly, do not hurt it. Let it live its important but short life. And I want to give a big thanks to my cousin Excel for being in my video. Thank you, David, for inviting me to be here. And I want to give a big thanks to you for watching my videos. Until next time, and remember, watch your step before you step. Because you never know what kind of creatures might be crossing your path.